many people struggle with their own mindset, their self doubt, and and their own belief, right? How how can people improve that area? Um, well, I think probably there's two things that I focus on quite a lot. A lot. So one is you know our response. So how do we res we can change that? That's you know something that really is in our control. So you know it's not so much what the situation is or what the challenge is or what that the thing that's happening around us, but it's our ability to respond. And again, yeah. sometimes having that big picture, looking at it from a different perspective can be quite powerful in shifting our response. And then that can change, you know, how we feel about it and the, and the outcome. And the other thing that I really like, and this is something that my one of my coaches said to me leading up to the games, and it was probably about a year out, and I was training, you know, at the club in Brunswick, <laughs> and he said to me, are you training right now like you're an Olympic gold medalist? And it wow. was such a profound question. And I was like, yeah, or no. <laughs> and I realized that I was training as if I was trying to be a gold medalist. I wasn't training as if I was one. And right. so he started to work with me around how that would feel. And it was about, for me, training it as though I was, not as though someone else was or, you know, Susie Q, Joe Blow, the per that I see being a gold medalist. But what is a gold medalist? You know, what is Lauren Burns the gold medalist? How do I want to be and feel and you know, stand in the ring, how's my, what does my body feel? And so I realized that there were these little tweaks in, you know, and I was training at a high level. I'd won world championship medals and, you know, international competitions. I've been traveling the world for, you know, years, but there were all these little tweaks that I realized when he asked me that question that mm. changed in my physiology. And so it was like, how do I want to be and how do I act as I am a gold medalist? And so he would ask me that question you know, multiple times throughout that year, you know, different training sessions, you'd just be like, are you here or are you there? You know, like, are you at the Olympic Games? Are you training like a gold medalist? And so that was really profound for me and it changed the way that I prepared and it changed the way that I held myself in the ring on the day. And so now I've sort of translated that to other areas of life. And I think that it's quite a good kind of model to check in with ourselves. And it's, you know, how would I act if I was a really kind parent you know how would I act if I was a really engaged employee or you know when I was studying and doing my PhD especially when I was really over it and I couldn't I was just like oh my god and I was writing up the thesis you know I'd say to myself how would I act if I was a really organized and productive student and so what it did is it changed it got me out of my head and sometimes you know it got me into the movement and the action and my behavior and in, by changing that, it actually changed my state. So, you know, when I said, how, how would I act if I was a productive student? Sometimes it was like, well, I wouldn't be faffing around the house, cleaning up, because I studied a lot at home, um, you know, putting the washing on, making something for dinner, you know. So it was like, I'd get timers and I'd do this and I'd set. And so it changed my behavior. So I think in terms of mindset, asking yourself that. these questions, yeah, can be really really powerful so you know how would I act when you know as a really you know, engaged attentive fun partner mm -hmm. so you know what are the things that I want to do when when I see my partner and it puts it more onto us as well mm -hmm. you know our actions rather than just you know oh I wish my partner did this or that well actually you know how would I act and how does that start that you know because it's that old saying of you know for things to change first I must change and so sometimes we have to um, you know look at ourselves and I think that you know asking those questions can be a good start <laughs>